or Mana Surge, whichever one's better. Wow. Dude. She's good. She's pretty good. Hey, I thought you were going to heal and not drop my money. I try to remember though. I try my best. This. That's some good healing right there. It would be the far end one. I almost went to the far end one, but that one seemed too obvious. Dad nabbit. Since we have high pixie, it should let us through. Joiks. Yeah, I figure Persona is the only games where they're actually Personas instead of Demons. Yeah, I should look at... Uh, Setanta. Because he is our level. He seems to hit harder than Troll. He's got more health. He's weak to curses and nerves, though. Nerve attacks. So that kind of, eh. And with all these ice ones, it's probably better to hold on to troll right now in the party rather than use Satanta. Ugh, he has no skills either. Mm, yeah. I won't use him. Now what? It, why would I go that way? No. Am I planning to get Dante in my run? I have no idea what you're talking about. I fought Dante and I beat him. I haven't seen him since. He said he was gonna figure out what uh, old Hercules up to. I, if y'all are asking me questions about future game events or future possibilities in the game, I'm never going to know what you're talking about. The answer is I don't know because I've never played this so I have no idea what happens. And here I was wondering what kind of demon was trespassing. Why, you're only a harmless child. You cannot pass through here by luck alone. I hope that you do not bore me. Pixies, play with them. Peace out, pervert. What? I'm no pervert. Round two. Fight. There was a treasure chest containing loads of Magatsuhi under the communications tower. Sakahagi used that to summon a powerful demon. It reflects physical attacks. <sighs> Game. Why you gotta do this to me? Why you gotta do this to me? Of all times. How did it come to this? I, that's what I want to know. How did it come to this? Reflex physical attacks. Are you serious? Are you ready? It would do that. So I'm going to be completely useless in the fight because I'm physical and my heals suck. Oh my god. 
gosh. What's up, no dot? Game is hard? Uh, I don't think it's hard. I mean, it's tough, but I don't think it's like super duper hard. This just kind of sucks, period. Yeah, so you want it only physical, huh? You were gonna go physical, luck, vitality. Physically. I think you want that game over there. Shoot. That's what happens when you build a team solely on strength. But I'm not building a team solely on strength. Only I'm I'm the only one that I'm focusing on strength. The other characters I want to learn spells. So like they can do stuff. She's got Maragi on and Matador's got force and I have other people with skills. So they're fine. It's just more me that I'm concerned about. Time to man up, gather physical and magical. No. I'm not doing magical, I'm still gonna do all physical. They resist everything. You just can't hit it. It's invincible. Sorry. Telling him to use magic is going to make him want to resist using magic forever. Exactly. Like, yes, the demon is going to be reflecting physical. That doesn't mean I can't beat it or I need to start pumping magic now. That just means I have to beat him with what I went with. I'm not going to change my build now because I run into one boss that it, my skills won't work on. That'd be a cop out. If I were to do that, people would be mad that I did that and didn't stick to my build. Oh, are we at like level 8? Oh, we're at backwards. Dang it. A life stone, of course. I don't like this fight. Yeah, Kushinado's a beast. I just have to hope that my character can heal enough to keep up, I guess. there buddy ow We get booted quite a few times. I, I, oh, yeah, 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 hey, <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. What? No, I don't have a life stone. Yes, I do. Mm -hmm. He's like, mm -hmm, cough it up, homie. Give it to me. I can offer you this. I needed the money.
focus and beam attacks, we all know. I don't use focus. I actually made him forget focus. Because I wouldn't use it. Ah. Uh, get out of here. Oh, whoa, where did we go? Alright. That random warp, though. A luck incense. I will take a luck incense, actually. Don't think I won't. I need more luck anyway. You're giving me free levels, lady. And for that, I thank you. Our luck is now at 18. Look at that. Go somewhere else. I don't want to. <laughs> Get lost. Dang it. I just cannot win for losing. Yeah, that luck, yo. The faster they boost my luck up, the faster I can level up something else. Go try the demon lotto. <laughs> Two of them, huh? Okay. Is is we got is is we got big crit chance up in here? Is that what happening? Is that what happening? Can you crit hit a counter? I hope so. That's some good XP though. Mr. Wilson and your Dennis. <laughs> hey, Mr. Wilson. Get out of here. Uh, shoot. I don't know. Oh, we got one right finally. Jeez. Thank you, game. I see. Ah. Oh. Ah. Well, dang it. I need more luck for more crits, though. Don't be t dodging. Everybody's about to level up soon, and I dig it. <laughs> I get to the end of the game to get very teleport you back to the beginning. Get out of here. That would suck. That would suck. Just wipes all your skills. All your levels. Keep your money. Oh, I almost did the same thing, didn't I? <laughs> Are you ready? This game is perfect in making your failures into battle experience. This is the game's way of telling you, you're not leveled up enough for the boss yet. So we're gonna kick you out of here until you're strong enough. Are you ready? I am ready. I'm ready for you to join my party, dang it. Why you gotta be level 57? 
Seriously though, like I am 10 good levels away from you. 13 levels away from you. Why do you gotta taunt me by being here? Really? Grinding the video game. Oh my gosh, we're so far back. But can I though? Will the game let me? It does. I was going the long way the whole time. I understand that you're trying to change the world. Are you sane? <laughs> oh, it's a minor detail. It's don't worry about that. I think you're sick. Well, I think you're gonna be dead. How about that? Wonder how many more game days are you tired of watching this game, Kaiko? I'm sorry. I mean, we're, we're still kind of on pace, it feels like. I mean, was this day 11? We did twice as many days for Persona 4, so I feel like. You know? I feel like we're on pace. You have done well coming this far, though I do not know if I should praise you or not. But your luck ends here. How now, mad spirit? My trap shall entrap you as you move. This falls out better than I did, could devise. Enjoy the waltz and pageantry. The high pixies of our kingdom are famed for. Oh, you just... Oh, you hope I finish before Christmas? I might be able to. We got a safe spot. She's just... You just want me to play some more trucks, Euro Truck Sim on Christmas, right? Or is it because you're not going to be here on Christmas to see the end? Kind of both. It was a Christmas theme theme of Euro Truck Sim. Ah, <laughs> uh, she hasn't decided yet. I see. Eh, a ladder. So I, I take it I need to climb this ladder. All you know is you're supposed to make your pumpkin cheesecake. Ah, hey, guy, American. What's good, man? Oh, the high pixies change positions? Oh crap. Man, what what am I supposed to do? Okay, so I go up here. I'm wrecked if I go that way. I can't even get there. So I can go up the middle here. And I can get to those two doors. It's hard. He needs to stop it now. That laugh, though. That cackle. It's that pixie look. Always lets him get the crits. Oh, Kushinada and Troll, I see y'all. 
she got more look. Look at her look. Holy moly. You just need some more magic, lady. You can leave the luck alone. Cure stun. Uh, you know what? We don't need that. Monokemia is next, right? Uh, I don't know what's next. Oh, she's gonna learn f Lucky Find. I will listen to you. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh I just have, happen to have this. Tetraja Rock. And he's just like, yeah, I just gained health, bro. D don't pay no attention here. Okay, go straight through. What a sneaky little creep. He got past us. Alright, this time let's try the cross formation. Uh, what? Is Monokemia any good? Um, I played... Again, it's kind of like Odin's Fear, except I didn't start it over as many times as Odin's Fear. I played like the first... I don't know, maybe 40% of the game before I went to Japan. And I haven't touched it since. So I don't really remember the game at all. Wait till the holidays are over to decide on the next game. Well, I wouldn't. S I mean, if we if we finish this before Christmas, I would wait till. I don't know. I would. I, I probably wouldn't start a new game until the people are back, because people are going to be traveling for Christmas. Christmas. She gives you the ultimate weapon. Thanks. All enemies, physical poison. Damage relative to HP. So, Blight is the same as Heat Wave, except it does physical and poison. So, I should just unlearn Heat Wave. Or, I should just get rid of. I'm just gonna get rid of uh, freaking Berserk. Berserk sucks. Give me more luck. Yeah, give me a point. Oh, I got a vitality point. Okay, I'll take vitality point. What am I doing for Christmas? I'm streaming. <laughs> I will be streaming. It'll be a long cast night. Christmas night. Christmas Eve won't be a long cast night, however. Make sure you get that KFC for Christmas since the Japanese there love the KFC for the holidays. I don't like KFC. If I were to eat from a chicken establishment, I'd rather have churches or Popeyes. KFC sucks. Those high pixies, they change their positions every time you pass under them. There's a cross formation and an X formation. Try checking them out from a platform. Well. How about they just let me pass and let me go on about my business? Yes, guy call. <laughs> they don't know why. Because KFC is a big American chain and a lot of people like chicken, so they just want to eat it because we like to. You got chicken fingers from A&W yesterday and it was soggy. <laughs> no way. Oh, that is terrible, Kaiko. What? Uh, when I was in Christmas in Japan, I don't know one Japanese person who went to KFC. Just gonna throw that out there. Not a one. So I don't know. Maybe it's just not a thing in Tokyo. But uh, I passed by the KFC that was there. It was empty. Everybody was talking about Disneyland, so I don't know. They put your fries in there upside down so they spilled out when you pulled out the bag. Oh my gosh, what a terrible experience. I'm sorry. You 
did drive through. Oh. Soggy chicken. I don't understand. I don't get it. I just don't get it. Driving back in the rain didn't seem worth it. Yeah, no. I don't want to do this fight. I sound different? Probably because my voice is getting tired. Uh, he passed us again! Okay, girls, X formation. What? What a sneaky little creep. He got past us. Alright, this time let's try the cross formation. What are y'all talking about? I'm not even doing anything. Uh, he passed again. Okay, girls, X formation. The mic? Oh, the mic on this headset's different. Maybe it's a little closer than it was a second ago. I don't know. What a sneaky little creep. He got past us. Let's try the cross formation. What are you girls talking about? I don't understand. Okay. I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing. You're making too much progress progress go back to the beginning yeah I guess so okay well now they're in a different formation I was there for an academic school year so uh, about a year it's 11 months Okay, so I tried that way and they got me. X formation. Okay. How much money would you say is good to stay there for a month? Uh, it depends on where you're staying. And, uh... It depends on where you're staying. Uh, the city that you stay in is going to make a huge difference. If you're doing a hotel. I was in a student dorm because it was school so um, I can't really give you an accurate account and that was back in 2009 2010 so it's been some time since I've done it but I mean it depends on where all you want to go what state or city you're staying in uh, what kind of hotel you want to stay in how far you want to travel how much you want to spend on food every day like you can budget five grand for a month and that still won't be enough plus you got to have a takey for the train and trains are expensive um, like you can go there as a tourist and spend 10 grand in one month easy like, really easy so it really depends
Hey, if you stay in Tokyo, it's going to be really expensive. Get lost? Where else was I supposed to go? Crazy? As a tourist, you can buy a pass for all the trains while you're in your country. Right, but the cost is different too, right? Um, I know that there's passes you can buy, but I think they're only for certain train lines. I don't think it's unlimited rides to ride wherever you want. If it is, it's really expensive and probably not worth the price. I would guess. Okay, so they're back to where they were at first. Where do I need to get to? I need to get to... I was there already. Where am I trying to go? Oh, that big door over there. Okay, so I need to get there. What pattern are they in right now? Cross pattern. Right? Or is that X pattern? Either way, they're in my way. I can go in the middle door and then I can go in that door. I'll probably have to go that way. Maybe. The dollar is stronger than the yen at the moment? Uh, since when? And if it is, it's not by much. Does it really even cover the Shinkansen? Because that's the Shinkansen is super expensive. How much is that pass, Kaiko? Because that seems weird. That seems like they'd be losing out on a lot of money. Letting people ride the train. Letting tourists ride the train unlimited, unlimitedly for free. Especially as closed off as they are as a culture. And not really... The older crowd not really open to major tourism in the first place seems weird that they would just let you buy a pass to ride everything for free. Unless it's like ridiculously expensive. Okay, so now I should be able to go this way. No, you weren't there! That pixie was not there. Do they have a site that has the prices of those? I'm curious to see what their prices are because that seems really weird to me. X formation. I don't know what X formation is. Since a couple months ago, Japan is going to end a recession again. Uh, they've been in recession for like 10 years. A dollar equals a dollar 20 yen. Right now? No way. No, it's not. Yeah, the yen is still stronger than the US dollar. One yen is 84 cents. Hold on. My math is backwards. It did drop a lot. Hold on. That was an old site. Hold on. Hold on. Never mind. You're right. That was an old site. My bad. I am Googling it. It was just an old site. Well, let me know that site about the train, though, because I'm really curious about that, because I've never heard about that before.
There, he's in there. That mannequin Sakahagi went into the communications tower site. All right. No, I read it backwards, but I said it the right way. The, what I the, what came out of my mouth was for the dollar to be stronger, but what I read was that the yen was stronger. That's why I said it was an outdated site because it was an outdated site from like last year or something like that. It wasn't updated. It was supposed to have the current exchange rates, but it was for like last year. He said talks to the Japanese consulate for it. You have to ask the consulate for that. There should be a site that has that pricing. Like it shouldn't be some super secret thing you have to ask the consulate about. Otherwise that wouldn't be. Like if they want a lot of tourists to be able to use that pass to get money from tourists. That should be like an openly public thing. And you shouldn't have to ask the Japanese consulate for it. Three hundred dollars for a JR line pass. Unlimited rides. Yeah. Okay, so it's exactly like I thought. It's only for one line, and it, the price is about what I thought it would be. So it's not like you can you can ride the JR line, but you can't like if you switch the Yamanote in, then you have to pay again. Otherwise, it won't let you through. So it's only for one line. So as you, if you can just ride JR line to where all you need to go. And you're going to be there for seven days and you're going to be riding the train a ton. It's worth it. If you're going to be walking everywhere, it's not worth it. That's 300 bucks. Curse you. How have you made it past all that all of that unscathed? Rascals, you grow bolder with each passionate day. But you shall fall into despair this time. A trash to platform. Trash. <laughs> you know what, troll? I'm a member that. And not just that, an entire legion of my best troops awaits you. Now you will die. Alright, Oberon. Whatever. I don't care about the platform. The door is locked. Will you unlock it? Yes. The door is now unlocked. Okay. Ah. Ah. I got you. 239 bucks. Yeah. That's kind of pricey. Cuz I mean, I walked a lot in Japan, but I still had to take the train a lot of places, and I paid 200 bucks a month for my takey. Um That's what I was going to say, but you came from the inset. So what's in there? I want to save it really quick and then we go back in there cuz it's been a little bit since we saved. So let's go do that real quick. Then we'll go fight old Sakahagi if we can get in his area. We have to save in Shibuya. Yeah, I wouldn't buy that pass, honestly. I mean, I guess... I guess if you don't understand Japanese, it's probably a good thing to do. But it would just be cheaper to buy your own takey and just load money on it. You can always just go to the Bank of America and exchange your cash for a yen. And just put takey. Put money on your takey. 
If you're gonna be longer than that, if you're gonna be there longer than a week, if you're only gonna be there for seven days, then yeah, I guess it's okay to not have to deal with the hassle. But that's a lot, because if you stay there for a month and you buy that pass, you're talking a thousand bucks for trains. You better be riding that thing a lot. You make nothing useful. Legion. Right, you. Oh, hey, look, I can make this thing. Just travel across the country for a month. Would you take a taxi across the whole country? Hey, I can make this thing. Well, I don't like Ankhad anyway. But let's make a Raiju. Just to get rid of the stupid dude. <laughs> you don't want to take a taxi across the whole thing? It's only going to cost like 30 grand. You know, nothing too shabby. Oh, well, Shikome leveled up. I forgot to save it. Oh well. Um. Oh, I could make a phantom. That's cool. Sukukaja. Maybe I'll get Sukukaja and Tarukaja. He doesn't really need Berserk. Oh, I can make Jin, but I don't want to do that. That'd be stupid. Hey, cool dude, bros. That's double your student loans? I wish my, 30 th my student loans were that cheap. That would make me a very happy camper. Very happy camper. Beseech. Yeah, sure. Dude, seriously, if I can get all the schooling done that I want to do, the way that I want to do it, I'm going to be like 200k in student loans. By the time I finish my master's. <laughs> and if I go for my PhD, I'd be at around 230-250,000. Maybe more. Oh yeah. I don't want another Ankat. Why would you offer me that garbage? Tagarasu. Ew. I don't want you. <gasps> Sati! Oh! Ooh, level 48. I can make a Sati with Baihu and Troll. Alright. Baihu and Troll go nowhere. Raiju and Bapo Mat. Whatever. I don't care. I don't even think I'm going to have him learn Maragi on at any point anyway. Uh, you mean what would I study? I'm not in college or grad school at the moment. I'm trying to get into grad school. I'm trying to see if it's something I can do. Um, I would go for a higher education administration and um, um, possibly global studies and international relations I might forego that one and then just get a PhD anti-death would be cool to carry over 
want to refill. I want my hama on though. All that fancy pants fireworks show all for some bad demons like a tiger and fart gas. Wow. 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 I need that mana refill though. I know I could learn it. I've seen it once. I saw you. I seen you. My bachelor's in psychology, and then I have three associate's degrees. One in business administration, one in computer information science, and one in Japanese. That's partially one reason why my study abroad or why my uh, student loans are so high right now. The other is from studying abroad. It was about 30 grand to go study abroad because my financial aid department lied to me, even though I met with them like eight times to go over the finances. Uh, and their sister school, whatever, is the number one private university in Japan, so it's expensive to go anyway. Thanks. I'm going to get what I want, game. You are going to give me Mahamal and Mana Refill. I would I would be picky for Zionga too, but you're gonna give me Mazionga anyway, so it doesn't matter. These should come out with good Japanese. Yeah, but that doesn't mean anything if you forget over 60% of what you learned because you had to focus on finishing your other degrees. I've forgotten a ton. I was business level Japanese. I was doing I was doing business level stuff, conversations and all that stuff. and highly technical Japanese terms and all that as well and I've forgotten all of it well it's never really fully forgotten it's just like you need a, a major refresher and get back in the swing of it again and that's where I'm at you just paid your uni normally for your study abroad well, I still had my scholarships and stuff, it's just the cost they told me was different. Did you go to Waseda? I mean, it would have been a lot cheaper to go for half a year, but why would I study abroad for just one semester? So I went for the whole year. But the total cost was supposed to be only around 15k. And I met with like four people about it a couple of times. Like I seriously was there about eight times. And the numbers all came out the same. My scholarships, my grants, all that stuff would have been fine. I was supposed to get a nice refund back all the time so I could do traveling and do fun stuff while I was out there. And then I got out there and the school was like, oh yeah, you actually owe us another 15K. And of course I gave them crap about it for the longest time. And all they could do was just pass the book. Like, oh, well, so-and-so told you wrong, and so-and-so told you wrong, and so-and-so told you wrong. And I was like, I don't care who told me wrong. You all told me wrong. And this is what I planned for, so what are y'all going to do about it? And they're like, uh, nothing. So there you go. You didn't want to go to Tokyo? Uh, see, we didn't really have a whole lot of choices. Um... Wasada was like one of the few full year programs. I could have did like two six months programs, but that actually would have came out to be more expensive because of the school swap and travel and stuff. So I just did uh, Wasada. 
I'm working now. I'm not in school. I graduated in 2013. That's why I say I'm trying to get into grad school now. Oh, game. Just give me my Hama on and freaking mana refill. That's really all I want. After seven years, that is forgetting. Given, um, that's after seven years. If you file a bankruptcy and you defaulted on your loans, school debt isn't forgiven for 25 years, and that's only if you stay on top of payments. If your account goes into default like once, then it's never forgiven. I don't want mana drain. I want mana refill. I want it to refill as I walk. I don't want to waste a turn on Mono Drain. I'm going to unlearn that as soon as I can. Ah, your class schedule. Couldn't go for a year for a minor. See, when I went, I didn't even have the Japanese minor yet. I didn't get the Japanese minor until I got back. I just went because I wanted to have the study abroad experience and, and the global experience to be more marketable and experience a country I've loved forever. Well, as long as you're making good payments on it, so like, and now there's they have a new thing where it's income based. Like a lot of people think, oh, well, when I graduate, I got to pay like $600 a month on my student loans, all this stuff, yada, yada, yada. And you don't. You can sign up for income based repayment. They basically take all your bills that you have and your income and they work out a payment plan so you don't go broke. And if it takes you 25 years on that plan, as long as you pay the amount and you keep them updated with your income and you pay that amount for the income-based repayment plan, then it'll be forgiven after 25 years and you don't really notice it. I plan to pay it all off without having to do that, but that is a thing that you can um, do. Places may not pursue the debt because it's school debt, but it still will keep you from getting any type of home loan with good rates and stuff. If you let it default, you don't want to let something like that default. Even if it's school loan, you don't want to let a big multiple thousand dollar loan go into default. That's one of the worst things you could do. All right, well, we're just not going to have Maha Maon. We're going to take anti-death. No, we're not. We're not taking that. Crap. There's also forgiveness if you teach at certain schools. Yeah. Oh, your major was bio. I see. Yeah, there's ways you can get it taken care of. Thank you, game. That was that so hard. Maha maon and mana refill. I'll even take a needle rush. That's fine. Seems to have accepted you as its master. It better. <sighs> Let's see. Oh, I can make a Pazuzu. Don't want one. Thanks, though, game. So I gotta keep Baihu and Troll. Can't get rid of these. Can't get rid of these four. Five. The only one up for grabs is Phantom.
spent 10 minutes in there trying to get that. I think it's worth it though. Now if I wonder if I were to go back up the back way from the beginning, if everything would be cleared out since I got this far, or if the fairies are still there waiting to move me around. Alright. Ah, uh, should have known I couldn't trust it. Okay. And this isn't gonna work. Okay. Nope. Oh. Ah! Too good to be true. <laughs> oh, dang. And we're back here again, of course. Get lost, I am lost exactly. Don't tell me to do what I already am. Hey, what? You from behind? From behind, though. I'm basically just trying to manipulate the teleports to get where I want. Kind of works sometimes. <laughs> Alright. Shaka drop. No. Okay. Uh, just leave. You sense a strong power from beyond the door. Will you enter? Yes. Get me inside the door. Ah. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's nice to have visitors, but this is ridiculous. You too, huh? You should have thought twice before coming here. They all come from Magatsu here. But then they find out that it's already mine. There's a girl who showed up not long before you. Yeah, I taught her a lesson. <laughs> a painful one. <laughs> Didn't I tell you before? I won't be used by demons. With all my Magatsuhi, I'll be the one using them. Not just any demons, even the strong ones. That skin of yours will make a nice coat. So I can't join him. This game makes it... Like, sometimes the game makes it seem like you have choices. Other times it doesn't. Oh yeah, this dude repels physical attacks. 
Uh, yes, thank you, Kaiko. Yes, I do have a list to my actual gaming collection, so you can see everything that I play. Oh, it's Krishna or Vishnu, Krishna, Vishnu, whatever his name is. The big elephant thing. Yeah, it is boss time. What an entrance! That will show you everything that I own. Giri Mekala. I was way off. Whatever. Uh, I'm gonna do a red capote. I do some hot stuff sometimes. You're awesome, Kaiko. Grimakala. Look at that good. physical I can't do a thing man except give my my peeps some extra turns he can even do something I can't or he can do nothing don't smack your gut when you do that come on man don't smack your gut <laughs> that's that's just rude Don't punch him. Don't drop my money. Throw a mouse at him and he'll run away. <laughs> Stop throwing my cash, man. For real, though. He seems dumbfounded. Just be dumbfounded. Yeah. That gut smack, though. I can't handle that. Well, that was a good turn on his part, if I do say so myself. Let's revive her. Hey, Genesis Breaker. Yeah, he, he, he just pooped right all up on my face. Big old elephant dome. Thankfully, I can summon without the confusion. Can you stop smacking your gut, please, though? Like, for real. That looks gross. Stop blighting, man. Come on now. All right. 
I just cannot get away from the panic voice. Why did I bring him out? Why did I even bring out the Phantom? I thought he had Zionga. I'm thinking of a different thing. Last resort. No. Oh, he doesn't have Mazionga yet. He looks cool though. Wow, missed. Oh my gosh, the blight though. I can't handle the blight. Oh my goodness. Oh, stop being confused. Just do it. Oh, stop with the cash dropping, man. Oh, the beast eye. Please. I Take the poison off. That's why it keeps hurting, because I'm weak to spells. And it's a freaking blight. I should have swapped Magatamas. Alright, well, that's fine. I had to have him pass again until I can give him more MP so he can use some more of the, the focus thing. I do need to go some more with this. Um, I originally, my first cast was like June or July 2012, it was always inconsistent because college. Um, I've just really been able to get super consistent, like starting this August. I meant to... Dang it. I meant to give us some more dodge.
There is no health bars. There are no health bars. You just fight him until he dies and you hope. Don't be dropping my cash. Y'all have made me drop like a thousand books. Let's summon High Pixie. Of course. Ooh. Ooh. Hey. Hey. That was not even nice. That was not even nice. Dude. It's a good thing I have a lot of chakra droplets. This fight. The longest fight ever. Guess we bring back Troll. And he's gonna die instantly. How are we not dodging this? We've got max agility and he used red capote. How is he hitting us ever? Dodge that crap. At least it hits him twice sometimes. I love how the troll doesn't even move and if it dodges it just says miss. <laughs> He's too fat. I mean nice if he just had Bufula instead of my Bufula. Don't blight. Oh, come on, you should have dodged that.
Wow. Seriously though, can you die sometime soon? <laughs> How much HP do you have? Oops, that was an accident. I figured as such. Can you dodge something? Seriously. Just troll me. Please don't kill her. Thank you. Oh man, seriously though, any day now, you want to die, I'd be okay with that. Like, you could die right now, that would be really nice of you. Battle of freaking attrition. Dang, she got hit. Die already. Of course she dropped money. I'm pretty sure we've done more than 10,000 damage at this point. Lights though. Your counter. I wish I could turn it off. Oh my gosh, we did it. Whoa! Come on, game. Alright, well, we can at least hit him. You are a troll game. I should have known this was going to happen, but I can get in there and do this now. You're one hell of a monster. I used all that Magahats Magatsu heat to summon that demon and look what happened. Enough of this. Anyone who gets in my way dies. Okay. I got something for you, buddy. It's called a focus. You ever hit, been hit by a matador with focus? It's a beautiful thing. 
really beautiful. Let me show you in just a moment. Yeah. yeah. How are you not dodging that? Boom! In the face. Sa -sa 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 -sa. Stone bite. Let's just get everybody maxed out on the dodges. And <laughs> before he resummons Grim, that would suck. Alright, I'll take the free focus. Yeah. yeah. In the eye. How can I lose to a guy like this? 14k. Nice. See, he wasn't even hard. It was just a long fight. Give me that luck. Life gain? Oh my, you don't say. Raises max. Now, here's the question. Can life bonus and life gain stack? First try, y'all thought I was going to die to this? Come on now. He wasn't spamming Hama spells. Of course we weren't going to die. If these stack, then I'm gonna get rid of something else. If they don't stack, then I'm gonna get rid of life bonus. And this is a case where I'm actually asking for an answer. So if you know, please tell me. Do life bonus and life gain stack. If they do, I'm gonna get rid of heat wave probably. I'll probably just get rid of Dia, actually. They usually stack? Well, they don't in uh, the, the, some of those kinds of spells like that, that were the same, didn't stack in the Persona games. That's why I ask. I'll just get rid of Dia. Dia kind of sucks anyway. Lucky fine. Oh, baby. Now, here's the thing. She doesn't need Toxic Sting. They do stack. Thank you. We got the stone. You obtained the Yahirono Himorogi. However, the power of Magasuhi seemed to be absent from it. Great. Fantastic. Uh, Alright. How do I get out of here? Huh? What was I doing? Confirms they do stack. Sweet. What a weird dream. In my dream, I was a bad demon. Hee ho. No, it was not a dream. It was all Sakahagi's doing. We had been cursed by Sakahagi and were reduced to our primitive nature. Jaggard, I ask you to forgive our discourtesy. You may take the Yahiro no Himorogi as uh, you please. It is a sign of our gratitude. It has no power in it, and I took it anyway. So how was that a gift? By the way, before we were cursed, a human girl came here. She was beaten by Sakahagi, yet somehow survived and limped to safety, but I felt it evil power from her heart. Something even stronger than that of Sakahagi. <gasps> Mr. Kao is a bad guy? Oh no! That girl is not an ordinary human. Oh, excuse me. That was completely irrelevant. We shall take our leave. We all thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Please put the Yahirono Himorogi to good use. Okay. The fairies disappeared. And with that... I don't care. <laughs> Where's Mr. Kao? She promised me stuff, man. I want my goodies. Give me 
that. A bead, cool. Revival bead, cool. Game power doesn't mean nothing to me as long as they resist. <laughs> Physical, no resist physical. Exactly. Alright, so we found a save terminal. Just in Tizam. Because I didn't want to lose and have to do that fight over. But that's cool. We one shot a boss who should have been our toughest boss because I couldn't hit him. Uh, and <laughs> as you can see, our spells suck without uh, our beautiful, beautiful healer. So. Yeah, it was supposed to repel physical. Some of some of my counterattacks did repel. It's just I dodged some of them. Some of them hit me though. So Kushinada, I thank you. Matador is still a beast, despite what people ask me. Why are you still using him? And that's where I have to stop for the night because I got work in the morning. As always, same spiel. Sunday through Thursday, short cast nights, work, yada yada yada, blah 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 blah. Um, unless grad school goes how I want, and I can start grad school on the 5th, and then if I can get my classes to be in the afternoon, then I can have a long stream night every night. Until then, Sunday through Thursday is a short cast night, and uh, tomorrow is Friday, so a long cast night. We will be going about, what time is it right now? That four, five, twelve, one, two. We'd be going about another four hours longer than where I'm stopping right now. So, an hour earlier tonight? No. It's this is about the time I stop every night now. Um, Sunday through Thursday is the short cast. It's around now. Um, I'm sorry, Kaiko. Yeah, that just means you have to come back tomorrow, and we can kick it for another four hours tomorrow on Saturday. So thank you all for coming out and watching. We did make some good progress today. We got a big boss beat, even though I got lost for a little bit. I got lost for like 15 minutes, 20 minutes, and I spent 10 minutes trying to get a skills. We still beat a, a good chunk of boss single-handedly, and we did something else at the beginning of the stream. I don't remember what that was. That's okay. Um, yeah, I have to go lay down. Uh, yeah, average. It's it's around now because I still it still takes me about an hour to fall asleep. And then I only sleep for five hours and I have to work an eight hour shift where I'm on the phone for eight hours a day trying not to fall asleep at my desk. So, yeah. You'll be on a plane tomorrow night. Nice. Enjoy your plane. Darn you and your cliffhangers. <laughs> You'll get this on YouTube. Yes. All everything goes on my YouTube, so feel free to follow my YouTube if you want to keep up with that since they don't stay on here on the Twitch VODs. Um, follow my Twitter. I'm very professional talking while wiping my eye. Follow my Twitter and my U my Facebook or Facebook if you prefer one or the other. That way you know when I go live and then you can get here right from the get-go. Um, follow my Twitch and you can get a notification that way if that is what you prefer. Um, there's a bunch of links down below to the Jack Shop for cool shirts and swag and stuff. I've updated them. Um, I've updated all of the swag in there from shirts to cups to a mug that's not as big as mine but still pretty big it's 32 ounces and so that's cool I don't have a vector for any of my art I need a vector image that's got 2,000 or less node points for them to accept it uh, and then I can make things like hats so I don't know when that's gonna happen but you can still take a look at the shop down below as well everything is down below but uh, the biggest way I would appreciate more help and support is just by you know spread me around having people come in have some fun hanging out kicking with us all that good jazz uh yeah i'll check out the tweet thank you for that um but on that note i am going to sleep and uh, yeah i'm gonna host somebody what am i gonna host what have i never hosted before let's see let's see uh, 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 uh. Hosted, 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 recently hosted. Done that, done them. You know what? I'm gonna host Lethal Frag because I've never gotten a chance to host him before. 
he probably doesn't even know who I am, but that's okay. I love Frag. I've been watching him since he started streaming. So I'm going to host him. If you're a sub, you can tell him hello. If not, enjoy. Plus, I want to show him some support after his crazy fiasco having to deal with Amazon's ridiculousness. So I'm going to do that. You all have a great night. Thank you for coming out. We'll be back for Longcast Night tomorrow.